It's just Zuri. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to make a hide and seek game on code.org. Now I'm going to let you guys watch my screen. For a game of hide and seek, of course you need, you need a background. I'm going to make the background first. So I'm going to drag this block called set cave background in the actions area. I'm going to click. I'm going to choose which one I want. I'm going to make it in space. This is going to take place in space. And I'm going to make the first person, the one that's hiding, into... I'm going to do a bat in space. So, so first, there's a bat right here. There's a bat right here fly right there and I'm going to make the person who is counting so for I click actions and I click set actor 2 because the first one was actor 1 and the one that's going to hide the one that's going to count is a witch so actually I'm going to switch rules because a witch can has can do spells and and the witch will go will hide and pretend to be something else so i'm going to so you see there's a witch and there's a bat um, i'm going to make the witch say wanna play hide and seek I'm gonna play hide and seek for one second. The bat will say, first, I'll hide and you seek. The bat will count, will count. And then in the middle of it counting, I'll move after two, a random, Four hundred pixels, and then because it will move anywhere, it will move anywhere for anywhere four hundred pixels. So it can move down four hundred pixels any way four hundred pixels because it says random. I'm going to make the bat finish counting. Now I'm going to see what it'll look like. See, like. Like, did you see that? So it says, want to play hide and seek? Sure. I'll hide and you seek. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The I think the dinosaur tried to move up because he can't move up anymore. So I'm going to make the bat go to the the bat. You you're going to control the bat, and then the bat will go to the dinosaur. I'm going to make you guys you able to uh, move the bat. Now, I'm going to make it up and then down and then left and then right. So it says when you click up arrow, which is here or on the computer, the up arrow, down arrow, left and right. You can do those and then i'll wear up arrow i'm going to move after one up um how many pixels five pixels i think and then i'm going to make up five pixels but so up is going to be down and then five pixels left and then the two actions and then i'm going to see when um right and then Five. I'm gonna see how that works. 
Okay, wait. I can. Now they can move. But when they touch the dragon, nothing happens. So I'm going to make something happen. When actor one touches actor two, then then the actor, which where does it say that? Then the actor two. Says you you found me. You found me. And then and then says and then says wanna play and then the and then you would say wanna play again. Want to play hide and seek? Sure, I'll hide and seek. It's okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, there's nobody. There was nobody here. Hello, pony. Oh wait, that's the. That's the. That's the witch. And then when you do that, you can just reset, and then click run again to play again. I'll hide and seek. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, by ten. I found. Wait, who is this? And then I see. Who are you? I'm just a tennis girl. Okay, I'm going to see if you're a witch. Oh, you found me. And then you can, if you actually want to play again, then you can just click reset and run. And then you can just keep on playing hide and seek. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.